Hello and welcome everybody to the year 2000. Now, the Flamingo is not a casino I need to introduce. It's been around forever. Bugsy Siegel, famous. They made movies about it. Warren Beatty. And, I mean, it's just been around for... It's the oldest Las Vegas Strip casino still in business, okay? So, it changed ownership a whole bunch. I know... So, we're talking about this chip. So, for this chip, it changed ownership from... Hilton, I think they, I uh, forgot what the word is, sold it or renamed it or rebranded, I can't remember exactly, to some park uh, business. And then it ultimately fell to the name of Caesars. So it's under the Caesars name. You know, that's what the, you know, it's under now. So in 2000, when that happened, they changed the branding here on the chip. So for anybody interested in researching more about this stuff, my two favorite places to go when I'm researching chips, pokerchipforum.com and Chip Guide. So just type in Chip Guide. It's like through the morph or something and they have amazing information on Chip Guide. So two great resources that I personally use all the time. So looking at the chip, this has the oversized inlay, which some people really don't like. I don't mind it so bad. Uh, this is the first, you know, one for the modern ownership of Caesars Entertainment. And you can see how the inlay actually is bigger than the milled out area. For It's not milled, but it's stamped, but it's larger than the inlay area. So the inlay, the oversized inlay. All right, that's interesting for some people, but some people hate it. And this is just the RHC mold. So you can see the Hatton Cane mold out here on the perimeter. Different from here, do I have a, yeah, I do have a top hat and cane. So with the top hat and cane mold, you can see how there's a little line that extends or that is on the outside of those hat and cane molds. Can you see that? Is that showing up? This little line right here. And so they're kind of inboard a little bit more. This doesn't have that. So this is an RHC mold with just one yellow edge spot. Go all the way around here. Just one. I love that. That's so cool. So 2000, these were released. Welcome to the new ownership, Flamingo Las Vegas, Nevada. One dollar chip, this lovely light blue with the waterfall. What do you expect? Have you been to the Flamingo? You can see the lovely flamingos. They had penguins. Do they still have penguins? Penguins, Donnie and Marie. Are they still there? I don't know. It's been a while. Go. This lockdown thing has kept me away from Vegas for way too long. I need to get back soon. Either way, Flamingo, just a classic classic casino. This chip is not as, in my opinion, this is all my opinion, as desirable as some of the older Flamingo chips. When you're talking about names like Bugsy Siegel, you know, or, other, you know, back in the day when casinos were not just these huge corporate entities, they were super interesting. But, you know, for modern Flamingo, this is, this catered, this brought in the new modern ownership of Flamingo corporate. Here we go. So that's what we have here. And it's fine. You got to start somewhere. Don't feel like you need, you know, in order to collect chips, you don't need to buy the most expensive rare chips on the planet. Just buy what you like. And this is what I like. So let's play a hand at the Flamingo. Not really. It's here on YouTube and it doesn't even count because there are no betting cycles, no betting at all. And you could have the exact same hand that I do. So everybody at home, if you want, shuffle up your deck. We're going to play a quick hand. And I'm just going to repeatedly lose. I'm going to just keep on losing to Jane Doe, my imaginary playing partner here, over and over. Did you like that shuffle? That was beautiful. On my little card table. Copac cards are failing me. Nice weave shuffle there. What's going on? Well, that was a little bit better. Either way, we're going to get started. Okay. Jane Doe and myself. Have a look here. Obviously, you know, like I said, there's no betting cycles, so no folding or anything. We're going to flop. Let us know what you have in the comments below, everybody. And we have one more river here. Let's see what we get. All right. Well, I can tell you right now, I'm raising a lot. Because Jane Doe ain't beating me today because she only has nothing. Nine high for her. But look at me. 
I happen to have a boat. Ha <laughs> Take that. It's okay. I'm not a bad winner. Eat it. All right. No, I'm, I'm, I'm cool. It's fine. I, you know, pretend like I act. I mean, act like I've been there before because obviously I have. I've, oh, I always beat Jane Doe. So let us know your thoughts about collecting casino chips. Like, you know, you guys have seen lots of my collection. It's nothing really rare or expensive. It's mostly just stuff I like. Pretty modern, if not ultra modern. Let me know if you have any requests for chips you'd like to see. Can't guarantee I'll ever get any of them, but I'll do my best for some fun casino chips. This is one of my favorite things to do, and I love this content. I just have tons of this stuff, and I like it. So, so that's what I make videos about. And any other requests for even stock chips you want me to review, you can leave those in the comments below as well. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. I really appreciate my patrons. The support means a lot to me. You can also support me by visiting my Amazon shop. I'll put a link in the description below. I am an Amazon associate. I make proceeds from qualifying purchases. Thank you everybody for watching. Please subscribe.